if you are kind of torn between FreeCAD versus SolidWorks, which 3D CAD parametric software will be better for me, then this video is for you. In this video, we're going to compare FreeCAD versus SolidWorks. So first thing first, let's talk about price and licensing. If I talk about FreeCAD, it is completely free and open source. You do not require any license and it is also allowed to use commercially no restriction at all however when we talk about solidworks and especially when you want to use it commercially you need to pay a hefty amount and then this amount can vary from 2.8k to 3.5k based on you know the kind of license you are getting and that too only for a year if you are a student then probably you can get it either for free from your college or you need to pay a minimal amount of 30 to 60 dollar and then again i would say if you are using student version you may not able to use that commercially including let's say for example youtube video creation so if money is top in your list and you wanted something for free you do not need to watch this video from here onward you already got your answer free card is straight away winner in this regard but sometime you know there can be uh, so many other factors for example you might be learning solidworks not for your individual project or diy project you wanted to use it in your office premises and that's where i guess you know solidworks sign or solidworks come again into picture because free card is not generally used in big companies they generally go with these kind of software again um, when i say these they generally go with these kind of robust software like solidworks katia or creo however if you are an enthusiast or hobbyist or uh, you know you are just starting your business and you do not want to pay that hefty amount then you know free card is way to go now let's talk about platform and hardware and I would say in this category also FreeCAD win because FreeCAD is not only offered for Windows but it also run natively in Macintosh and Linux. However, when we talk about SolidWorks, SolidWorks is Windows only and actually now you can run SolidWorks in other platform but that will be running non-natively in cloud but sometimes you know those versions don't have that kind of performance. Um, there is one more walk around I would say when let's say you are running Macintosh which is you can install software like Parallels VM or maybe VMware Fusion. However again since you are not installing it natively performance still will be an issue. Now let's talk about the core capability which is modeling. In case of FreeCAD I would say when they launched the version 1.0 they made a huge leap in terms of handling of the topological naming problem and they also introduced the completely overhauled assembly, sketcher and part design workbench. Not only that, the FreeCAD also offered tech draw or drawing module, FEM, a new material system and so on. FreeCAD is also backed by a huge community that keep on building new modules and add on for it. When we talk about SolidWorks, SolidWorks is one of the easiest 3D parametric software available out there. Not only it is easy to learn, but it also offer a very mature and robust parametric tools for part, assembly, drawing, FEM, you name it. Not only that, SolidWorks also offers a dedicated PDM module that will help you to manage your product lifecycle efficiently which kind of missing right now in case of FreeCAD. Also when it comes to handling very large assemblies, in my opinion SolidWorks still tend to perform better in that regard. Now let's talk about the detailing capability of these both software. FreeCAD have a dedicated module known as TechDraw which is capable of producing basic production drawing and I would say FreeCAD tech draw is still in progress mode but for sure you can produce and draw production drawing out of it. When we talk about SolidWorks, 
is you know kind of one of the best in terms of creating advanced level drawing it also comes with all necessary tools that an engineer need to produce high quality drawing for example you can easily use zd entry create bomb also offer model based definition and so on so on this aspect i would say solidworks sign now let's talk about simulation and analysis freecad fem gives you open source simulation option for basic analysis good for learning and early check however when we talk about solidworks the solidworks premium tier offer linear statics for parts assembly motion and more right in your same ecosystem however one should note that none of these software are real simulation software so if you are really looking for fea or cfd analysis then you may need to switch to more high end simulation software such as ansys star ccm and many other so in this regard also just based on performance i would say solidworks again win now let's talk about cam and manufacturing freecad path now renamed to cam in 1.0 with new cam simulator i would say freecad is great for hobby to lightweight professional workflow when we talk about solidworks solidworks offers solidworks cam is an integrated and backed by a large partner network of post processor training and swap adoption now let's talk about file format and collaboration in this regard i would say both can read and write common neutral format such like step and igs they both also can handle stl and obj document however solidworks additionally work natively with parasolid and can also add katia translator at higher tiers so overall i would say solidworks have an edge over freecad in this aspect as well now let's talk about automation and customization freecad offer first class python scripting macro and a dedicated add on manager perfect for custom tool batch jobs and parametric templates however when we talk about solidworks solidwork offer mature api in c hash vb.net and c++ it also offer mature ecosystem and automation work well inside c++ it also offer macro ecosystem however in this case what i personally felt it is very easy to create macro and write python script in case of freecad so just because of the ease and then huge community support i'm going to give this point to freecad now let's talk about data management and theme so in this regard this point straight forward goes to solidworks because freecad is purely a parametric 3d cad modeling software it doesn't have any official pdm people use git and self hosted tool or neutral file in shared drives when we talk about solidworks solidworks offer pdm and 3d experience platform for versioning approval and collaboration baked into the product line if you need formal ecosystem and audit this matters so again in case of managing product like cycle solidworks win now finally let's talk about which software is best for whom i would suggest pick freecad if you are a hobbyist or enthusiast or you are tight on budget freecad still offers immense value if you are only looking for 3d parametric cad software not only that it also offers cross platform compatibility which means that you know no matter whether you are using windows mac or linux it is available for you you can also further improve your efficiency with very handy python automation tool plus a huge community support that already have created numerous of add-ins and plugins so there is a huge community support now let's talk about solidworks and who should pick it i think if you are a multi million dollar company then there is no doubt you want nothing but the best 
your client vendor or employer live in solid works and demand solid work part or para solid workflow then this is software for you if you build large assemblies complex sheet metal weldment routing or need simulation you should also choose solid works let's say you have a large team and then they are working on so many parts of product and then you also want a link or a software that can also take care of your different different product using pdm then choosing solidworks is no brainer i hope guys these differences might help you to choose correct software for yourself please do let me know which software you have chosen and why in comment down below i am very excited to see the responses you have made subscribe to engineering pritam to see more such videos and i will see you around